sailing on Western Port. Western Port's about, uh, about an hour's drive from Melbourne. A great place to sail. A lot of recreational sailors down here. There's uh, two or three good marinas. Um, we've come out of Uringa Marina, which has about um, 600 boats. A great many trailer sailors, masked up, stored in the yard. Great way to keep your trailer sailor. A lot of old blokes like me can't be bothered putting our masks up every time we go sailing, so keeping them stored is a marina life. I think is a great way to do it. Pretty cold today. It's um, July the 28th, uh, middle of winter, about 15 degrees. Not too bad. Well rugged up. Here we are in the channel leading up to the little harbour of uh, Warneet. Notice the mangroves growing along the sides. They're uh, reported to be the most southern growing mangroves in the world. Very interesting phenomena. Of course, uh, several boats moored in the channel. It's very shallow around here. You can see where uh, the, uh, the boys are and the, the boats are moored along the side of the channel. Ah, lunchtime already. Thank goodness. Alright, Lee Batoli. Yeah. Got a couple of beers there, you'd rather a beer. I'll get beer as well, yeah. But I might have, oh, I might have a light beer to start. Yeah, yeah it's, it's easy to go from beer to wine and the other way around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, there's two beers, two lights in that uh, fridge bag of mine. I'll oh, take mine, mate. Alright. Ah, have a look at this nice banato as we go past. Very, very nice. Need more than one crew to crew that one though, wouldn't you? Going back up the channel now. Notice the mangroves on either side. Boats moored along the side of the channel. Another memorable day on Western Port Bay with a couple of good mates. Notice how calm the sea is today, like a mill pond. The beauty of an autopilot, you can sit up, the, up on the bars if you want, as I often do with a cup of coffee. 